obesity is defined as having too much body fat because being overweight and having too much body fat are often associated. And the majority of overweight dogs will also have too much body fat. Body mass is easier to measure than body fat when determining whether a dog is overweight or obese. Dogs that are overweight weigh 10 to 20% more than their ideal body weight. Obese people are typically 20% heavier than their ideal body weight. Fat tissue appears to be metabolically active according to scientific evidence. By releasing hormones, it causes inflammation and oxidative stress in the body's tissues. Both of these factors play a role in the emergence of a variety of diseases. Obesity can be viewed as a chronic low-level inflammatory disease. An estimated 59% of dogs in the United States are overweight or obese, according to a study published in the Journal of the American Veterinary Medical Association. Data from a nationally representative sample of dogs examined by veterinarians between 2014 and 2016 was used to support the claim. Overweight dogs are the most likely to become ill in North America. And they make up 25 to 30% of all dogs. And 40 to 45% of dogs age 5 to 11 are actually overweight. Similar findings have been found in other studies. A study published in the journal Preventive Veterinary Medicine discovered that 63% of dogs in the United Kingdom were overweight or obese. And an Australian study discovered that 53% of dogs were overweight or obese. While a Canadian study discovered that 55% of dogs were overweight or obese. We're unsure at the time of this recording whether or not those dogs were eating poutine. Obesity in dogs can have serious health consequences. It can cause a variety of issues including joint pain, diabetes, heart disease, and certain types of cancer. It's critical for your dog to maintain a healthy weight in order to reduce the risk of these and other health issues. Unfortunately, the media is saturated with images of fat dogs, making it very difficult to distinguish between normal and extra fluffy dogs. Your veterinarian and veterinary health care team can help you figure out what's really going on inside your puppy. Feeding a healthy product with fewer calories while maintaining proper nutrient balance is important and correct. The healthcare team at your veterinarian can advise you on the best supplements for your dog and if they need them. These are interesting things with JC.